Hey guys, welcome back to Cobra Cast. I'll be your host, Dr. Cobra. Uh, bringing you a game today that I played. Uh, this is me over here, Dr. Cobra, as the Teal Protoss on Lost Temple against IVXX. I might just call him the Terran, because that's kind of hard to say. Anyways, uh, I'm going to be playing in a tournament this Saturday for cash, just at the university. Not a big deal, but I have been uh, laddering a lot recently to try to uh, you know, practice up. I don't really know the skill level of any of the other players. I don't, I mean, there's 60, supposed to be 64 players, so it'd be nice to win, but, uh, you know, I won't be too disappointed if I don't win. Anyways, another thing that we got going on, uh, is this is a build that I've been practicing lately that you see a lot more on, uh, Asian servers. Uh, but I guess you're starting to see it some on the American servers. So, you'll see what that is momentarily. Anyways, built a pylon out here at the choke. Out front instead of at the ramp. And got this lonely probe scouting all around. See what he can see. Not much going on yet. Here we go. IVXX starting to throw down that barracks. A little late. He had 100 minerals extra. And the first building we got coming down is a gateway for me. So when you see this walling off a choke up here like this, you can pretty much assume a pretty quick expansion. Because that's, I mean, that's really the only reason you want to have a complete wall off like that. IVXX going pretty standard. Supply depot, barracks, refinery, another supply depot. Pumping out SCVs. Or, actually, I guess he's not pumping out SCVs. But he should be pumping out SCVs. Finally, my probe scout gets in here. Able to find the base. And he's just now sending his scout out. Meanwhile, I got the forge almost done. Here's the cybernetics core going down to complete the wall off. I am so good that I've psylocked myself. So, did manage to complete the wall before he was able to scout. Yeah. So that way, I'll, my tech, if I choose to get any tech, will be hidden for a while. This probe's still scouting around. That marine's gonna push him out of there. Probe has got some sort of crazy waypoints going on. I don't even know. Wants to come back. Probably wants to fight this marine. Anyways, there you go. Pulling him off. Gonna send him over near this watchtower, I think. This SCV, still on his long journey all the way around the map, has not found me yet. And got a first cannon coming in right here to defend this wall. Meanwhile, pretty, pretty early Ghost Academy uh, coming out for IVXX. Got the Marauder stem. Uh, got a Marine, got a Marauder out. Um, so he's looking for a kind of early push with ghosts for that EMP. Uh, so here comes the first ghost out. Here comes a pylon up on the high ground. This next has been coming down for just a little bit. Still chrono boosting out probes, trying to get an early economic advantage. However, no fighting units out, still. Got a second cannon coming down on the high ground, which will be good, because uh, IVXX won't have any spotters in this army since he's going for ghosts instead of medevacs. Pumping units out of two barracks. Looks like he's going to push out a little bit. These guys are going to be spotted by this probe. And this probe... Looks like he's scouting for an expansion. These, uh... Terran bioforces just ran right past him. Here's some more running right past him. Probe falling in formation. And they're still not even going to shoot him. There he goes, back to his position at the watchtower. Nexus is up, building a couple more gateways, getting warp gate on the way, getting out a stalker, finally. First military unit. Here comes this Terran bio. Let's gonna poke its head in here, take a couple shots from the cannons. 
Oh, and it's able to go up to the north, and there's no cannon up here to defend the cybernetic score. The cybernetic score is going to go down. That is painful. This stalker's going to come out, not going to be able to do anything, really. Starting to chrono boost out a couple stalkers right before that cybernetic score went down. And the forge is in range, too. So that is going to set me back quite a bit. Chrono boosting out some more stalkers. Trying to micro them back to help these photon cannons protect them. Uh, so now, all I'm able to build is zealots. Because my cybernetics core and my forge were both taken out. So getting a couple zealots out. Uh, IVXX has thrown down his factory and his starport. Getting out of medevac. Um, either to heal and try to get, you know, bust his way through the front door, or he could try a drop up on the backside, because this is really undefended. However, I am thinking a little bit ahead. Gonna put some pylons around here, hopefully gonna be able to catch a drop if it is to happen. Finally got that forge out again. Just now putting it down another cybernetic score. Kinda late. Getting in some more zealots just to help deal with this. Where is this probe? He's been taking forever to put down. There's the cybernetic school. And folks, we have a nuke on the way. A nuke and an expansion both coming in for IVXX. So he's sitting out here at the watchtower, macroing up a little bit. Got his medevac. Putting down a couple extra cannons to help defend with those excess minerals I have. Medivac is gonna come up here, drop one Marauder. Gonna try to snipe this probe. Snipes the probe. Going for the gateway, the pylon. All the other forces are gonna be able to spot up here because of the Medivac and the Marauder up on the high ground. Take out that pylon pretty easily. And the gateway is gonna go down too before they are forced away by this little group. Marauder is picked up and dropped off safely. Uh, Protoss Ground Weapons Level 1 coming out of this forge. Still boosting out Stalkers. If you remember, that Cybernetics Core got killed early in the game before Warp Gate was out, so still don't have Warp Gate. Uh, which is really late in the game for not to have Warp Gate. I'm gonna throw down a couple more pylons. Power this gateway again. Got two Medivacs. This Medivac has a ghost in it. Trying to not get caught by these Stalkers. Looks like he's going to go around outside the view of the Stalkers. And... Yeah, he's going to be dropped up on this high ground, which is going to be very annoying. Uh, this orbital command is almost done. Oh, and a nuke is launched right on this expansion. Let's see, can I find it? I did find it. Almost all the probes able to evacuate. Except for this gas probe, and this probe that just came out. So, a couple kills with that nuke, nothing too much. Pushing out to attack this force that's been sitting at the watchtower. Oh, the force has kind of got split up, some bad micro there. The stalker's now going to come up and engage the rest of this army. Doesn't look like they're going to have enough to kill it off. This medevac comes in, being able to heal, being able to tank a couple shots. And these marauders are going to take care of the rest of those stalkers. This ghost is being super annoying. Going to shoot down this cannon. Don't have anything to spot up on the high ground. Uh, there is a Twilight Council out. No research from it yet. Just trying to get some stalkers out. And another nuke is coming down already. Probes are going to be able to get out of there again. I think every single one of them is out this time. So this nuke... Not going to do much. Might get this assimilator. Yes, there it goes. Another nuke on the way already. Terran infantry le weapons level 1's coming out. These probes need to get back to work. Throwing down a robotics facility uh, to get an observer to get this ghost up here. Who is being terribly, terribly annoying. Probes are back to work now. Massing up a bunch of stalkers to deal with this army out here. Let's take a look at IVXX base. 
Producing off of four barracks, three of them with tech labs. Got that ghost factory, making more nukes. Getting a reactor out of the last one, pumping a couple medevacs. So still going bio. And infantry weapons level one still coming out. Gonna throw down another nuke this time to try to get these gateways, maybe kill this nexus. Probes are gonna get out of there in time. Uh, don't know that this is gonna do too much damage. And actually didn't kill anything, but this ghost is gonna be able to snipe that pylon if he wants to. Got another engagement out here. Sorry if I missed the beginning of that, but those nukes are so fun to watch. His marauder stimming up, trying to kite. Doesn't look like there's gonna be enough of them. This ghost caught out of position. Two ghosts caught out of position. Rally points got them killed. These stalkers are gonna be able to pop up all the rest of these guys. This marauder gonna go out attack all on his own. Probably not the smartest idea. This pylon did get sniped, but this pylon's still able to cover these two. Where's that observer? There's that observer. Stalkers finally take out that ghost right before he kills this gateway. Finally able to throw up that assimilator again. And let's look at the income tab. Uh, Dr. Cobra has 39 harvesters over 25. And look, his income is basically double that of IVXX. Uh, which I think is going to be uh, the deciding factor in this game. Protoss ground weapons level 2 coming out. And IVXX is in a little bit of trouble right now. Doesn't have enough units, really, uh, to hold off an attack right now. Is getting out Siege Tank and Siege Tech uh, to help defend his base. Uh, looks like once that Observer got out, gonna pump out a couple of mortals. Might as well. Uh, still never got anything from this Research Council. Not a good idea. Finally got Warp Gates up. Still just pumping out uh, gateway units for the most part. Gonna throw down a couple forward pylons. Here comes Zealot Legs, finally. Uh, Terran Infantry Armor Level 1 coming out. Getting a couple missile turrets, or at least one missile turret. Where is that bugger? I don't know. Looks like the infantry is pushing out. They're gonna get intercepted by this Protoss force, warping in some more zealots to help deal with these marauders. On the retreat, got a lot of free kills there. Looks like Dr. Cobra's gonna push in here. Nice EMP going down, taking down the shield some of the stalkers. The zealots are gonna push this bio all the way back up the ramp, while the stalkers and a couple zealots are gonna come in here and get a ton of SCV kills. Uh, here comes the observer giving sight up the ramp. The stalker's gonna go ahead go up, push into the main base, try to take out the army. This expansion, all the SCVs are gone. Reinforcements in the form of an immortal. It's wasting time killing these refineries. Gonna be able to shoot up here, take out the rest of these marauders. No, pulling back. Siege tank, sieging up on the high ground. Should be able to do a good bit of damage. However, more reinforcements being warped in all the time. Another immortal on the way. This siege tank is gonna go down, the Marauders, Marines, not gonna be enough. Observer goes down, but the missile turret. But just not enough units anymore. There's the GG. Uh, so yeah, hope you guys enjoyed that game, and I'll see you next time.